Fighting out of In This Corner Boxing Stable by way of La Pason Sambuanga del Norte, here is Ronald Alapormina! Magpapatuloy po ang aksyon sa ating Night of Champions 17 with a light flyweight battle na pagitan ni na Melvin Manangkil and Ronald Alapormina. Carlo Pamintuan po kasama pa rin si Dennis Principe. Ngayon si The Weights Manangkil at the limit of 108 pounds. Itong si Alapormina made the minimum weight limit of 105 pounds because Dennis paminsan kasi sa dalang ng mga laban you take what you can even if it's a light flyweight battle kahit na minimum weight contender ka talaga if the opportunity presents itself you jump on it yes of course at yun na nga yung uh, uh, ginawa dito ni uh, Ronald Alapormina and even on the part of uh, Melvin Malangkin taking someone mas maliit eh, still took on the challenge flash grand ballroom El Orde Sports Complex, Sukat, Paranaque City, ESPN5, in association with El Orde International Production, is proud to present our next battle for this boxing event. This bout is brought to you in association with PACOR. The three judges at ringside, Virgilio Garcia, Gerald Tomeldan, and Danilo Lopez. And inside the ring, in charge of the action, Referee Ferdinand Estrella. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, eight rounds of professional boxing in the minimum weight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing blue trunks, official weight 105 pounds, professional record, four victories, including one win coming by way of knockout with three defeats and one bout even. Fighting out of In This Corner Boxing Stable by way of La Pason Sambuanga del Norte, here is Ronald Alapormina! <laughs> and now introducing his opponent across the ring, fighting out of the red corner, wearing black trunks trimmed with white. Official weight 108 pounds. This boxer holds. A professional record consisting of five victories, including one win, coming by way of knockout with six defeats and three bouts even. Fighting out of El Orde Plus Boxing Stable of BF Homes Paranaque, here is Melvin Manangkil! Second fight of Night of Champions 17 underway. Manangkil contra Alapormina in this light flyweight matchup. Normally, sinasabi natin kung ano yung kulay ng trunks. Ngayon, yung buhok na lang. Manangkil, yung blunt. Itong si Alapormina, yung itim yung buhok. Mas madaling tignan. Yes. Pagandahan ng forma sa loob ng ring and pagandahan ng gupit. Si Alapormina, yung unang pinitawan na kombinasyon with mean intentions immediately. As our veteran referee for the Estrella warning them not to lead in with their heads. Baka magka-aksidente, magka ng ating oh. dalawang boksingero. Tsaka masira yung forma ng mga buhok nila. Laban ng isang galing sa parlor at isa naman sa barbero. <laughs> <laughs> Magkapit-bahay yata ito sa, ano eh, sa Zambuanga del Norte. They're both locals of that area. Looking for their spot in Philippine boxing dito naman sa Maynila. Mas magalaw itong si Alapormina. And uh, Malangkil. Medyo nahihirapan dun sa galaw ano, uh, ni uh, Alapormina. Because si Alapormina, after bimita ng combination, lumalayo agad. Melvin Malangkil. Five wins, six defeats, three draws with one knockout. 
Sa kabilang banda naman si Alapormina. Four wins, three losses and a draw. May isa rin tong knockout. Kung titignan mo yung uh, dalawa, partner. Record-wise, mas maraming laban yung uh, malangkin. Mm -hmm. Pero sa galaw, parang mas maraming laban itong uh, Alapormina. Naririnig mo yung bato eh, no? Talagang kahit yung body punches ni Alapormina is thrown with really good force. Yung warning mo lang dyan is don't be too wild kasi paminsan mawawala ka sa balance eh, dahil sa lakas nung gusto mong ipatama. Yes. Pero for the most part, partner, ano, dito sa first round, maganda yung mga uh, combination ni Alapormina. He's gaining a lot of confidence dito sa laban na to, partner. So, yung bulk ng adjustment after this round, ay eh, mapupunta rito kay Melvin Manangkil. Three-pound advantage para kay Melvin Manangkil. Sa mas matataas na weight divisions, wala na yung 3 pounds na yan. But here, minimum weight contra light flyweight can make really the difference in the, in the matchup. Eh, one division na uh, apart na nga yun eh, no? yung uh, 3 pounds na yun. Biro mo from 105, plus 3, 108, second division na yun. Hard! Fighters exchange and that is the end of round number one. Round two action about to start. Ronald Alapormina contra kay Melvin Manangkil. Ba. Clear round for me, you know, in scoring that uh, first three minutes. Uh, Alapormina, I think, uh, he's done more than enough para makuha yung round na yun. So, tignan natin kung anong adjustment ang gagawin dito ni Melvin Manangkil. Number one dyan, yung ring movement. Although, Ala Formina, medyo sumasabay ngayon, partner, ha? Nagipagdigdigan sa loob. One thing na pwede natin i-critique dito kay Ala Formina is madaling basahin yung pinanggagalingan ng mga suntok niya because he, he really pulls back bago niya bitawan. So, if maka-adjust itong si Manangkil, makita niya kung saan nanggagaling, that might just give him the opportunity to evade yung mga malalakas na pinapakawalan ni Ala Formina. Yung sinasabi nga ni Freddy Roach, partner sa, ma, sa paborito nating 24-7 ng bawat laban ni Manny Pacquiao. No? Parating niya pinag-aaralan yung habit ng kanyang, uh, yung kanyang makakalapan. And yun nga, yun siguro yung napansin mo, may habit ito si Alapormina. Low blow. Yep, clear. Very low. Uh -oh. Neutral corner. Neutral. Go, go, go. Boom. Pangalawang warning na yan. Kanina sinabihan na ni referee for the Estrella to keep it up. Pass mo, ah. Sinabi ko na sa'yo, may pass mo. Pagka nag-warning pa ako ng isang beses. Oh, that was really low. Wala kay Alapormina. A stern warning from our referee. One more, and it will cost him a point. Manangkil will have up to five minutes to take a break, gather his bearings before resuming action. Bihirang bihira sa isang boxer na ito. Time Maximize yung five minutes ano. Doon makikita yung nature ng isang boxingero. Sige, konting break pero kung kaya na, laban na. Eh, nangyari nung huli nating nagka, nagka-partner. Ayun <laughs> 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 na. Eh, lumaman pa rin. Pero problema. Hindi na lumaman si Amerikan eh. Oo. Umayaw na eh, no? 
And going back to your point earlier, Dennis, uh, I still remember the, the line itong si Freddy Roach very clearly. Sabi niya, we don't, we don't look for mistakes because you never know when mistakes are going to happen. So mahirap to take advantage of it. What we look for is habits. So ano yung ginagawa mo, ano yung nakasanayan mo, at dun nila kinahanap yung mga pwedeng pasukan. Yes, because uh, yung mistakes pwede mong itama yun eh. Now, partner, ala por mi na cornering si Melvin Manangkil. Di ko alam kung tama ba yung nakita ko. May dugo ba yun? Or... Mukhang meron na, partner, ha? Sa likod, eh. Sa likod. O oh, baka naman tape nung ano. Nung uh, ropes Possible. natin Possible. dito, Possible. ano? Oh. That punch was just on the belt line. Para kay ala por mi na. Mukhang tape lang, eh. Hindi no? naman na uh, kumakalat. Okay. Maganda yung uppercut na pinapaama ni Alapormina. And he's Another doing... punch that was low there. A uh, an impressive uh, fight plan, partner. After moving around, throwing punches and moving around a lot in the first round, dito sinabayan niya si Manangkil and I believe pwede niya pa rin makuha itong round na to. Itong si Ronald Alapormina. Taking another look at the action. Ganda nun. Pinpoint accuracy to the body mula kay Ronald Alapormina. And that overhand right hand landing on the side of the face. I think Parter Manangkil is having a hard time in terms of uh, reading the punches ni Alapormina. Hindi niya malaman kung bibitawan siya sa katawan o sa muka. And on the part of Ala Formina, nababasa niya naman kung saan humihigpit yung depensa ni Manangkil. Kung saan yung uh, medyo may opening, napapasok niya agad. Saka Dennis, naunahan siya eh, no? Na, naunahan talaga siya sa dami ng suntok, sa lakas na rin. Really good start for Ala Formina. Tignan natin kung makarecover pa itong si Manangkil. So, ngayon, wala pa tayo nakikita ang magandang ginagawa rito si Manangkil except yung kulay ng kanyang buhok I think ala for me na feels na parang mentally nagsiseg-destruct itong si Manangkil kaya pinapasok niya He was able to land a good combination there three punch combination mula kay Manangkil pero bigla tikit na naman itong si ala for me na not giving him space to operate. Kita mo si Manangkil, hindi komportable pag dinidigitan na siya ni Alapormina. He wants distance to be able to hit with his combinations. Tough test para dito kay Melvin Manangkil. Yung mga sungkit sa bodega, yung mga uppercut, short ones. Paying off for Alapormina. Yun nga lang, kailangan niya mag-ingat talaga. The referee already warned him twice. Another low blow will cost him a point. And in an eight-round battle, masakit pag nabawasan ka ng isang punto. One round parati yun, partner. Especially if you lose that round. So instead of 10-8, 10-9, mabibigyan ka ng 10-8. Malaking bagay yun. Alapormina still forcing Itong si Melvin Manangkil to fight with the ropes behind him. Ginagamitan na rin niya ang laporta ng tulang partner. Wow. I think he's very lucky here na pagbibigyan pa siya ng isang warning pa lamang. I thought the referee was going to give him a point deduction there. Kahit na mainit ang panahon ngayon, partner, mahaba pa rin ang pasensya ni referee Ferdi Estrella. One of our veteran referees. Alam din naman kasi, partner, ni referee Ferdi na... Oh, na big sadya. punch! Oo, oh, ma mabigat yun, yung kanan na yun. Alam niya na hindi naman talaga sa jack ni uh, Alapormina, pero... He cannot just rely on that, eh, no? na, na, na clean fighter ito. It's just that minsan mababa lang yung suntok. Tsaka yun talaga yung punti rin ng atake niya eh. Katawan. Oo. 
kasi he can't blame uh, referee Ferdi kung mangyari pa yun bigyan siya ng uh, point deduction uh -huh. Kaya, medyo may tulak na lang sa katawan you know, si Alapormina Dennis, I think you'd agree Dennis Manangkil will have to do something drastic para palitan yung tema nitong larong ito ngayon uh -huh. because inside and out parehong kuha ni Alapormina yung kanyang uh, timing This was the action in round number three. Yun yung pinakamagandang combination. Nitong si Manangkil, but he was clocked with his overhand. Bumayo talaga yung ulo nitong si Melvin Manangkil. As referee for the Estrella, now approaching the corner to remind yung boxing hero nila to keep his punches up. You'd hate for something like that to cost you know, a deserving fighter. Uh, the result of this match. Tsaka, you take that as a sign, partner, na nauubos na yung pasensya ng referees. And chances are, if that happens again, mabibigyan ka ng point deduction. Yung tanong ngayon, para sa corner, nitong si Alapormina, papalitan mo ba yung atake mo? Will you go ah. to the body a little less yes. to prevent that from happening? And remember, partner, yung uh, napapansin nga natin, maganda yung body attacks niya. No? Doon nanggagaling yung kanyang uh, opensa. Doon, doon niya natin jump start. Ano? Ito mukhang nasabihan itong si Melvin Manangkil that he needs to do something really different. Holding, holding. He's trying to start aggressively here in round number five. We heard one of his corner men telling Manangkil na sumunto ka ng marami. Ayun na no, ng uh, very basic partner, eh, no? And uh, they can feel uh, they're lagging, you know, uh, dito sa laban na to. Melvin Manakil trying to change his fortune. Sa laban niya kontra kay Alapormina. Well, he's getting more active, pero wala pa rin. Hindi pa rin masyado tumatama. He's still uh, missing the target. Yung gusto mangyari ng kanyang uh, corner, partner, ito si uh, Manangke. Atras ang konti, bato. Kasi pagka di kita na, katulad niya, no, hindi na makabitaw si Manangke. Alam po rin na lang yung uh, tumatama. Kapag naramdaman mo yung lubid sa likod mo, kailangan mo nang gumalaw. You have to go away from that situation. Be able to decide. Do something. Kasi alam mo na dyan sa sitwasyon na yan, magaling si Alopormina kaysa sa'yo. But apparently, partner mo kang walang uh, footwork si Manangkin. Well, yeah. He was able to get away a little bit. Pero, pero bumalik lang siya. <laughs> pero rinig din natin yung corner niya. Huwag kang sumuntok ng malapitan kasi hindi yan yung skill mo. Yan yung gustong mangyari ni Alapormina. You have to have your distance yes. kontra sa kalaban mo. Eh mukhang ganun ang style ni Manangkil. Carlo, no? Yung uh, istansya, jab. Kasi narinig natin yung corner niya. Sinasabi, gamitin mo yung laro mo. Pag may distansya, nakikita mo yung skill. Eh. Nakikita mo yung galing ni Melvin Manangkil. The problem is, sa 3 minutes na round, Halos 20 seconds lamang yung nabibigay sa kanyang espasyo ni Alapormina. Yes. Kung hindi, nakadikit siya. Parang ganyan. Eh, yung Alapormina, very consistent. Ano? So tough to disregard yung uh, work rate ni Alapormina. But still, this is a much better round for Manangkil as compared to the last two kasi nakapitaw din siya ng mga malilinis na suntok. Ang tanong na lamang, will he be able to convince the judges to score this round for him? Round six of a scheduled eight rounder. Light flyweight matchup. Kapakita ni na Melvin Manangkil, who's only 21 years of age. Kontra kay Ronald Alapormina, 23 both from Zamboanga del Norte. 
Ang Formina debuted way back in 2016. Tuloy niyang laban, December 2018. Ito namang si Melvin Manangkil was able to fight already in 2019. Had a match against Pit Anakaya, which he won via unanimous decision back in January. Alpha! Dennis, your scorecards, ano yung basa ngayon? Well, lamang na lamang, itong si uh, Alapormina sa akin. No, although yung last round, uh, pwede mong ibigay kay uh, Manangkil because uh, he did uh, some adjustments uh, in that uh, round. Pero, ito mo, dominated pa rin yan. Alapormina itong laban na ito. La Formina, ayaw talagang bigyan ng espasyo. Manakil, parang nag-punch out dun from the corner. Ang music, a variety of punches. Get up! Come on, break! Step back! Naikinatuwa na ka ng corner, man. Pwede naman palang ganun eh. Pwede pala siya sumuntok from being cornered. Rapido, binitaw niya kanina. Pero ang tanong, hindi niya masustain. Naghanap ng paraan si Melvin Manangkil. Take control of this matchup. Alam man niya yung gagawin ni Alapormina eh. So it's a matter of adjustment. It's a matter of putting things together. Siyempre, dyan mo rin makikita yung galing ng corner itong si Manangkil kung mapayuhan nila hmm. on what to do to turn this fight around. Tama naman yung payo ng corner ni Manangkil. Itong si Alapormina. And now, he finds himself being back up to the corner. Pero pinabayaan ni Manangkil, he was not able to press that advantage. Loose tape on the left hand ni Alapormina na agad namang nakita. Ni referee Ferdi Estrella. Neutral corner. Neutral corner. Oi, ho, ho! Gusto pa sana ng mga 5 seconds pa ni Ella Porvina para magpahinga ng konti. Not given to him. Ito, binibigay na ni Ella Porvina partner in distansya pero hindi pa rin makagalaw si Manangkil. Doon doon, tumama ng left hook. See the corner imploring. Itong si Melvin Manangkil na bumalik dun sa pinaghandaan nila. Because right now, he is allowing Alapormina to dictate what will happen, what's happening in this fight. Okay, bring it up. Pero ngayon, mas makamay na si Melvin Manangkil even if he found himself cornered once again by Alapormina in that round. Round number six, that was the best punch itong si Melvin Manangkil in this entire matchup. Can he build on that here in round number six coming up? The fifth round was close. I gave it to Manangkil. And I think yung, uh, yung fifth. Check it out. Uh, pwede mo rin uh, ibigay, you know. Rather yung fourth round kanina binigay ko kahit na close ah. Manangkil and then yung uh, fifth dito again kay Manangkil so at least uh, sa akin and sa atin unofficially Manangkil is just around uh, behind uh, dito sa laban na to so 3-2 na you, did you score the sa first atin, three for Alapormina yeah. yeah unofficial score all card. for Alapormina pero yung ano niya yung work rate niya bumaba na rin he's still 
cornering itong si Melvin Manangkil. Pero ano yung ginagawa mo pag naka-corner mo siya? Not the same as the result of the first three rounds. At saka partner sumasablay na yung mga suntok ni Alapormina. Nawawala na ng direksyon. Ito na, nakakuha na ni Manangkil yung kanyang distance. Tinatiming na, no? inaabang niya lang yung kanyang kanan. Dennis, mga ganitong boksingero nakakaumpisa pa lamang halos ng career, how often should they be fighting? Well, at least uh, every two months, three months. Ito, mga eight rounders ito, at least every three months, eh, lumalaban itong mga to. Especially sa division na to, which is very active partner. Madaling uh, hanapan ng laban dito sa atin yung mga flyweight, light flyweight, and even minimum weight. May factor ba na itong si Alapormina first fight pa lamang niya ngayon 2019? Depende kung paano siya nagbakasyon. Part na yun ang tanong dyan eh. Ang parating uh, issue sa mga boksingero natin eh, pag nagbasko, alam mo naman sa atin, uh, hindi problema pagkain. So it depends eh, no? But uh, basically, ang, ang, ang March uh, uh, fight date, mga yun yung minimum eh, no? na lumaban ka. If, if, if you're someone who's dedicated sa gym, February would be a, a nice fight date also for you. Normally, alo for me na. Ngayon pa lamang lalaban, makayo na. Tignan natin, if you'll be able to make up for lost time against Melvin Manangkit. dininig naman niya yung warning ni referee for the Estrella to keep it clean. Wala nang low blows na binitawan si Alapormina since the third round. Pero naka-apekto kaya yun. Partner sa momentum niya. Because since then, eh, parang uh, nawala yung kanyang ano eh, no? Yung kanyang accuracy sa laban na to. So, yung bentahe niya kanina, no? Yung kanyang inside punching. Sinabi natin kanina, dapat malaki yung adjustment na magmumula kay Melvin Manangkil. Eh, yung adjustment, yung pagpapalit sa laban, mukhang nanggaling kay Alapormina because of his lower work rate in the past three rounds. Eh, nabigyan itong si Manangkil ng pagkakataon bumalik sa laban. Well, to Manangkil's credit, uh, Carlo, nag-exert naman siya ng effort to... Uh, to the right uh, adjustments ano, to implement the tamang uh, fight plan and that is to get the needed space para makatama na siya pero I agree with you malaking uh, part nung uh, turn around right now because we believe na lamang na itong manangkil sa ano lang ah, sa momentum medyo nakakuha na ng tamang momentum is that uh, bumaba nga yung work rate ni Alapormina Kita mo yung first round, tinakbuhan niya lang si Manangkil pero tumatama siya, 1-2, 1-2. Pagkating ng second round, binomba niya sa loob. Again, maganda yung kanyang uh, naging plan ron. Third round, uh, combination din, maganda rin. Ano? Uh, loob, labas. Pero fourth round onwards, parang bumaba. Eh, no? Parang naubos si Alapormina. And uh, sa ngayon, I think wala pa yung second win dito kay Alapormina. At tignan mo to Dennis, first minute of round number 7, eh, hindi pa na nalulubid itong si Alapormina, si Melvin Manangkil, something that he has done aggressively and continuously throughout this fight. Ngayon, nasa gitna lang sila, which is the strength ni Manangkil. And he was successful. Doon sa tactic na yun. Pero ngayon, tumama siyang gandang combination from Alapormina. But now, Manangkil is fighting back from the ropes. Bumibitaw siya ng marami suntok. Four, five punch combinations to get out of that corner. Yeah. 
That's the halfway mark of round number seven. And I think that's the activity of Melvin Manakil. He has Ala Pormina in trouble right now. No holding, no holding. Can he get in space? Yeah, Ala Pormina. Kaya Manakil is taking advantage of that. Partner, I think it's good for him to see Ala Pormina. I think it's over. We can see that the momentum was turning in favor of Manangkiel. Can he take advantage? You know, it's just to be sure that this Manangkiel is still going to be knocked down. Because you don't know how the scoring went in the first four rounds of this match. Well, the first three were clear for him. The fourth, I said, either way. So, if you get that from Manangkiel, and I gave the last three rounds to Manangkiel, Pwedeng lamang pa siya sa laban na to. Manangkil. Going heavy on that uppercut. Apparently, partner nakatulong pa kay Manangkil at this point. Ano, yung uh, mababang activity niya sa first three rounds, sabi nga natin, hindi sumusuntok. Nag-aabang lang. So ngayon, siya naman yung uh, bumabato ng uh, enough uh, volume. Stop! Nagtipid pala, eh. nagbaon ng gasolina here in the latter part of the matchup. That's the end of round number seven. I don't know if you'd agree with me, Dennis, but I think round number seven was the best performance of Manangkil in this matchup. Yes, I gave that round sa kanya. At ala por mina, mostly... Tulak na lang, no? At saka, just for the sake of punching, yun ang ginagawa ni uh, Alapormina. He's trying to uh, maka-fake yung kanyang ano, eh, no? performance doon. Alam niya na inakapos na rin siya. But the fact that this is the last round, alam mo, ibang fighters, parang pagkaalam nila na final round na, nakakuha ng uh, needed energy para makakuha pa ng at least isang round sa laban Touch na ito. Touch love. Come on. Touch Despite love. Up for grabs para kay Alapormina para kay Manangkil. And we should expect heavy leather to be thrown between these two fighters competing in the light flyweight category. Hindi po, pangalawang laban pa lamang natin sa Night of Champion 17 coming to you from the Grand Ballroom inside the Lourdes Sports Complex. Manangkil finding his rhythm early in round number 8. And his range. Binibigay ni Alapormino yung uh, distansya, partner. Good ride from Manangkil. Alapormino tried to do what made him successful in the first four rounds. Pero buibitaw na rin ang puntong si Manangkil. Yun yung adjustment, eh, no? Yun yung sinabi sa kanya ng kanyang corner. Pag nalubid ka, bumitaw ka na marami. Yun. <laughs> Good uppercut from Manangkil. But Alapormina, nagtatsaga pa rin, moving forward. Trying to look for an opening. Trying to look for a big punch. See here, yung stamina ay mas marami talaga kay Manangkil at this late stage of the match. Nakapagod din yan eh, no? Yung, mm -hmm. yung bumibira ka ng mabibigat na suntok tapos walang tinatamahan. Hindi tinatamahan, oo. Oh. Nakakabawas ng energy yun. Kasi lahat ng momentum na yun, ikaw rin yung sasalo eh. Yes. Meanwhile, Manangkil just... Sticking to his guns. Baba yun, ha? Oo, hindi pwedeng madedaktan siya dito. It might cost him the matchup. Final 70 seconds of this matchup. Lipad yung tape mula sa glove nitong si Alapormina. Alapormina needs to win this round para sa atin. Hindi binibigay sa kanya ni Melvin Manangkil. He's fighting activity with activity. And 
this was a dog fight between oh. these two fighters. Tactical then, partner. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Adjustments, counter adjustments. Again, saludo tayo sa matchmaking ng laban na to, Carlo. What a fight. Our second offering for Night of Champions 17. They exchange at the bell. Melvin Manangkil. Not Ronald Alapormina. Entertaining the fans here. May batok po rin si Melvin Manangkil. Alam mo, Philippine boxing, especially on TV, kailangan natin ng mga ganitong klaseng laban. Relatively unknown, no? especially sa mga baguhan ng mga fight fans. Pero, ma-appreciate mo yung bakbakan. Lalo na kung nandito tayo to give them the right oh. <laughs> description. No, we're not saying na kami lang ang... Uh, uh, kunin dito ni uh, Boss Lloyd na naloto. No? <laughs> no, but we, we're saying yung, yung TV coverage, yes. napakalaking bagay para sa mga batang boxingero. Oo, uh, uh, at uh, kung ano eh, basta weekend, walang problema. <laughs> <laughs> so, yun na yung PBA ako dito. <laughs> Hindi. It's, you know, kahit naman wala tayo rito, I'll, I'll, I'm supposed to be here naman eh, no? because uh, in-anticipate ko na, no? na maganda yung matchmaking. Mm -hmm. Uh, maganda yung mga laban. Like, uh, sa ating live streaming, we saw two uh, interesting and very active uh, bouts. Natuturuan yung mga fight fans, especially yung mga bago. No? Na kung ano ba yung, ano, how do you score a fight? Ano yung mga tinitignan mo, mga connections, uh, fight plans, adjustments. Let's pass it on to Audrey Goriseta with our result. Ladies and gentlemen, after eight rounds of boxing, we go to the scorecards. Danilo Lopez scores about 77-75. Alapo Rumina. Virgilio Garcia has it 77-75. Manangkil. And Gerald Dumeldan scores about 76. 76, we have a split draw. After all that, the fight ends evenly. A split draw. Isang card, 77-75 para kay Alapormina. Same score, but for Manangkil. And our third judge scored it evenly. Four rounds apiece, 76, 76 for a split draw. So that will be the fourth draw for Melvin Manangkil. At uh, pangalawang draw naman para kay Ronald Alapormina. Tama lang para sa akin. I agree with the uh, scoring. No? Dahil makikita mo yung tatlong judges talaga nahirapan din. Eh, no? And uh, pare-parehong uh, uh, close scores yung uh, nakita niya. Which... Is the story uh, of that bout? Talagang uh, napakahirap pa uh, yung entire fight.